1939, when the Nazis invaded Poland, he, Thurber uh, heard about this and, and was so upset by it that he sat down and wrote this book in 48 hours. And it's, um, it's a parable in pictures. So it's more than it's, there's some words to it, but it's mostly his, his drawings. And, and I don't want to say cartoons, but they are sort of like cartoons, drawing what, what he would do in The New Yorker. Um, the book itself is, it, I've divided it into six sections for myself. And it starts out in the beginning of World War XII. And there's total destruction. And in the destruction, at the end of all of that, um, everyone, everything is gone. Art, uh, well not everybody, but mostly everybody. Um, and then of course he has rabbits descend upon the art. Because he always has to think about rabbits. Um, so the second movement that I do has to do with, with that devastation and that destruction. And in the midst of that, there's a young woman that finds a flower. And she's very excited because, of course, all the flowers had been destroyed except she found this, this flower. So she goes around and tells everybody. Everybody's just too depressed to even talk to her about it. But she finds one young man who then goes and looks at the flower with her. And then they become a couple and then civilization is reborn. So then the next, the fourth movement is, is about that. The third movement is about her finding the flower and the young man. The fourth movement is about civilization being reborn. But just like in our total cycles, civilization is reborn and then there are people that want to live in the mountains and, and kick those people out and people want to live in the valley and kick those people out. Everybody wants what you know, everybody else has, and then generals and dictators come up, and then now we got World War XIII. And there's war once again. Sound familiar, right? Like this is kind of like what's going on in our lives. And, and again, everything is destroyed, but one last flower, one woman, and one young man. So, it's six movements, and uh, here we go. Oh, I should warn you, we start with bombing. <laughs>